So here we're dealing with some calipers. We're going to be painting the raised letters. These are Corvette calipers. So first step is to paint your calipers. Uh, you can watch one of my other videos. I'll put the link below for how to paint calipers. Now you want to use some really strong high heat primer. In this case, I'm using Sika primer. And you want to use a foam brush, something that has a straight line, a straight edge to it and is somewhat uh, not too flimsy and what you're doing is you're basically not going to brush it on you're just going to go and you're going to apply it on little dabs so you want to make sure your brush is neither too wet with paint where it's going to drip or too dry where the dab isn't going to give it a full covered black finish on each dab so you're just going little steps at a time the important thing to remember when you're doing raised letters is not to rush it because if you go ahead and rush this you'll be doing it twice and if you screw it up you can imagine uh, you may have to go back to the previous stage of actually painting the in this case atomic orange um, it'll just create a big disaster for you so take your time go slow and just slowly Dab it on, little dabs at a time. Don't push too hard. You don't want that paint to go over the edge of the letters. And here's the finish. Now, don't worry if the paint looks smooth. By the way, you could use matte black, flat black, gloss black. It doesn't matter because you need to now seal it with clear coat. Otherwise, you're not going to have a very reliable finish. So the next stage I'm going to do here is I'm going to hang up the calipers and I'm going to clear coat the entire surface, including the letters and the rest of the Atomic Orange. In this case, the Atomic Orange, uh, which is a Corvette color, uh, really comes to life with clear coat. Uh, notice that I'm going to seal the entire thing. Now take note, do not do this while your letters are still wet. When you paint the letters, let them fully dry 100% then the next day or at which point it's fully dry go ahead and scuff them scuff the entire surface of the caliper and then go ahead with the clear coat so here you can see I've done three coats of clear got a nice really really smooth finish giving it a lot of depth it's really hard to really see how nice they are in video. They look just stunning in person. And there you have it. This will last a very long time and it'll withstand pressure washing and it'll take all the abuse of the road. That is how you paint raised letters. Thank you for watching. Hit that thumbs up if you liked what I did and subscribe for more.